Hello students, welcome back to Friend for Learning. Today, our lesson is about 10 more and 10 less. By the end of this lesson, students will be able to add 10 to a number and subtract 10 from a number. When we say more means we add and when we say less that means we subtract. Let's have a quick look at the definition of addition. Addition means finding the total or sum by combining two or more numbers. This is usually called as the plus sign and it is written as plus. Also, let's have a quick look at the definition of subtraction. Taking something away from a group or number of things is called subtraction. This is a minus sign and it is written as minus this way. You can visit this link if you want to have more idea about subtraction. To understand this lesson in a better way, first you must familiarize yourself with these terms. That is ones and tens. Are you wondering what is ones and tens? Here we go. When we say ones, it means one number of object. And when we say tens, it means ten number of objects. For example, have a look at this picture. For ones, I have placed here one block. For tens, I'm placing ten blocks. Count along with me as I place. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Always remember the place values. This is going to play an important role for this lesson. Imagine I have a number 56 here. The first important thing you need to do in this lesson is you have to write the place values for this number. That is ones and tens. Okay, what is in the tens place? Excellent. Number five is in the tens place. Also have a look at another example. I have a number 70 here. First, we will write the place value for this. That is ones and tens. And what is in the tens place? Well done. It's number 7. Let's have a look at some of the examples to understand this lesson. What is 10 more than 24? First, you have to write ones and tens. Ones and tens. Tens. And what the sum says, 10 more than. It means we are going to add the tens place. Okay? And what is under the tens place? Excellent. It's number 2. So you are going to increase the value of 2. Then it, the value of 2 will become 3. Well done. And we are not going to change the value of 1's. It will remain the same. So it's going to be 4. Well done. So our answer is 34. Let's see the same example using 1s and 10s blocks. For 2 10s and 10 blocks. 1 and 2. That is 20. And now for 4 1s, I'm going to place 4 1 blocks. 1, 2, 3, 4. The sum says 10 more than. So I'm going to add one more 10 block. Here it is. So it becomes 10, 20, 30. That is what the 3 stands for. And how many 1's blocks are there? 4 1's block. And that is what the 4 stands for. I hope you understood this sum. And now let's have a look at another example. Now, and now let's try subtracting 10 from the same number. What is 10 less than 24? So first, you have to write the place values for the number. That is 1s and 10s. Well done. Now, you are going to read the sum carefully. What it says? 10 less than. Less than means you are going to subtract. And 
what you are going to subtract the tens place. Well done. And now we are going to subtract the tens place. Where is the tens place? Here. And what is under the tens place? Number 2. So when you subtract tens from number 2, it becomes 1. And, and we should not do any changes to the ones place. So it will remain the same. That is 4. Now let's look at the same example using the blocks. So for two tens, I'm going to place two tens blocks. 1 and 2. So two tens blocks. That is 20. And now for four ones, I'm going to place four ones block. One, two, three, four. And look at the sum. What the sum says? Ten less than. So I'm going to remove one ten block. So what I have now? I have one ten. And that is what the one stands for. And how many ones? Four ones. And 4 stands for 4 ones. So my answer is 14. I hope you understood this. Let's have a look at some more examples. What is 10 more than 86? So first, remember to write the place value for the numbers 1s and 10s. And what the sum says? 10 more than. So we are going to add 10s here. That is, 8 will become 9. And no changes should be made to 1s. So it's going to remain the same. That is 6. Well done. What is 10 less than 8 is 6? First write the place value 1s and 10s. And we are going to look at the sum. It says 10 less. That is subtract the 10s place. So when you reduce the 10s place, 8 will become 7. And you should not make any changes to the ones place. So it's going to remain the same. That is 6. Well done. Now let's look at another example. What is 10 more than 55? First you have to write the place values. 1s and 10s. And now look at the sum. What it says 10 more than. In that case you are going to add the 10s place. So what is the 10s place here? 5. And when you add to the 10 place, it becomes 6. And 1's place remains unchanged. So it's going to be 5. Answer is 65. And now, what is 10 less than 55? First, you have to add 1's and 10's. And then, what the sum says? 10 less than. It means you're going to subtract from the 10's place. So, what is 5 less than it becomes 4 and the ones place remains unchanged and now the answer is 45 well done let's have a look at another example what is 10 more than 10 so your number is 10 first you will write the place values ones and tens what the sum says 10 more than it means you are going to add the tens place so when you add up to the tens place it becomes two and one's place remains unchanged so your answer is 20 and what is 10 less than first you have to add the place values ones and tens and what the sum says 10 less than it means you are going to subtract from the tens place so when you subtract the tens place, it becomes zero. And the ones place is already zero. So basically your answer is going to be zero. Well done. You have mastered the skills. Thanks for watching Friend for Learning and subscribe to my channel on YouTube. Also visit our website www.friendfullearning.com to receive more educational videos, PPTs and other resources. Thank you and stay safe.